For the second time in just over a week, the NFL is dealing with tragedy. This time, the team at the center of it all is the Dallas Cowboys. One player, Jerry Brown, is dead. At one time, he'd been a member of the Hamilton Tie Cats practice roster. Tonight, his friend and fellow Cowboys teammate is facing manslaughter charges after a night out on the town took a fatal turn. Robin Stickley explains. Jerry Brown and Josh Brent were college teammates at the University of Illinois in 2007. In October, the friends were reunited when Brown joined Brent playing together again, but this time as Dallas Cowboys. Saturday morning, the friendship ended in a fiery crash. 25-year-old Brown is dead, 24-year-old Brent charged with intoxication manslaughter. Skid marks line the Texas roadway where police say Brent lost control of his car. It appears as if he was uh, traveling at a high rate of speed, at which time his vehicle touched or impacted the outside curb of the service road, causing his vehicle to flip at least one time. Brown, a linebacker on the Cowboys practice team, died hours later in hospital. When our officers arrived on scene, uh, Mr. Brent was removing or, or dragging uh, Mr. Brown from the vehicle. Police say Brent failed a sobriety test at the scene, and according to court records, he was charged with DUI in 2009 and served jail time in Illinois. This morning, bond was posted at half a million dollars. Brent released a statement from prison that read in part, I will live with this horrific and tragic loss every day for the rest of my life. Compounding the tragedy, a recent Facebook posting from Brown indicates he was about to become a dad. For the NFL, it's the second fatal tragedy in just over a week. On Friday, police released this video. You live right here? You just need to go upstairs, dude. It shows Kansas City Chiefs player Jovan Belcher hours before he would go home, kill his girlfriend and the mother of his baby before taking his own life. It has to go down as one of the darkest sort of spans in, in recent NFL history. During warm-up before today's game in Ohio, Brent and Brown's teammates were visibly shaken, struggling on the field and reaching out to support one another. Players lined up for a moment of silence before kickoff, the Cowboys owner saying each one promised to play the way Brown would want them to. Robin Stickley, Global News, Washington.